Good morning, and today I'm going to show you how to um, create images for your designs that you've digitized, create your color charts, and then zip the files um, in order to get them ready to upload to either your Etsy store or you know wherever you're selling your designs if you're thinking about getting into selling your designs so right now I am in uh, the Embird manager and I'm in um, a, a little directory called cute reindeer faces and if I, um, I I work in Pez so I'm gonna go down here let's see if I like hit the first one it's gonna come up and it, you know it's going to turn the design to the orientation of the hoop so this is what this little design looks like so say I want to create my color charts I will select every single one of that format and it doesn't matter which format it is because the color charts basically the same and what you would do is you would say on, on the right panel up here left click it and then go down here under export put in export detailed documentation or alt D next it's going to come up with a color catalog if you do more than one color catalog it's just going to get really you know, uh, busy in, in your color chart so just select one try to get one of the popular brands or uh, try to get like this uh, was done with Floriani select the Floriani color palette and say OK do you want them to use all the same title say yes and it's gonna come up and it's gonna have a JPEG extension because we are saving them as JPEGs and what I do on mine is I come over here and I say color chart and put a dash and then I will select this and I'll do uh, see what it's highlighted here I will do a control C I will say OK I don't want to do all right here say OK this will allow everyone that comes up for me to put the color chart in so I just keep my mouse over where this first letter is I will do a control V hit return click control V hit return and just assign all of the you know the images with the color chart so that it knows you know so that the user knows that this is um, the color charts for the designs that they just purchased so the larger your set and the more sizes that you do you are going to have to um, actually paste this in a few times or type it in I used to type it in and it's like you know let's use the computer for what it is and just paste them in so I'm gonna hurry up and get these done there's shouldn't be too many more okay we are done with that now what we want to do is select our images or uh, create our images so again I'm going to select all of the one uh, in a format I'm doing a control over here and uh, well I'll click the first one I go up and do a control and left click again and it's going to uh, select all of them this time I'm going to do the right panel export and I'm going to say um, export image and it's going to come up and ask you what height that you want and I do uh, 600 by 600 pixels and I just say OK now for this one since it's not a color chart and it's just the image um, of the design I'm just going to go ahead and say all and that way it's just going to create them and if you look up here all of a sudden all of the you know the JPEGs came up and here are the color charts and we can see it if we go into um, the directory here you know let's see get it listed by details 
here's all the color charts and for each you know design there's a JPEG or if we do it by type you'll see all your color charts and then all of the design images so if I make these large icons again you know you can you can see all of them okay now if you want to um, take it from here and zip everything up I would suggest that you have your you know uh, terms of, of use already in the directory but you just go over here you click uh, do a shift a to select everything and me personally I don't send my EOF files out because those are your your little digitized files so I will hold my control key and I will individually select all of my EOF files because I do not want them included in my zip file okay you have all of that done you can do your right panel again and then say add the zip file and it's it'll ask you do you want to create single archive containing all the selected files you will say yes of course you can zip them in each format like all the pezes all the pus all the jeffs you know you can do it however you decide that you're going to uh, distribute your files but you can say yes here and then it's going to ask you for your file name say Q. I'm just going to say cute reindeer faces because that's what this set is and it just uh, created the zip file so if we go over here we should see the zip file let's see bring it to the top so you can see it there's the zip file that it just created so anyway I hope this helps you um, you can if you want to actually look at one of what one of the color charts looks like um let me get them back up here real quick so this will show you um like the colors that are used uh, it tells you that it's a Floriani it tells you what color it is things like that how much it's used for each one it shows the image the dimensions but this is a color chart so enjoy hope you like hope you learned something please you know, pass it along to your friends thanks bye